Here's an easy question for you. At least I think it's easy. What's the motto of the Marine Corps? Did you say Semper Fidelis, or the abbreviated version that Marines use with one another, Semper Fi? Hello, Father Kubicki here, and I thought of that motto in conjunction with today's saint, who began life with the name Mark Roy, but changed it to Fidelis when he became a Capuchin Franciscan friar in the year 1612. The Marines use that motto, Semper Fidelis, or Always Faithful, to describe their loyalty and commitment to one another. I'm not exactly sure why St. Fidelis chose that name, except that there were earlier saints who had that name, or perhaps he was hoping that with the name, he would also find the virtue. And what a virtue it is to be faithful. It isn't easy. I think that's why so many people today fear making a commitment. They're afraid of being faithful to permanent vows in marriage or religious life or the priesthood. But those who are faithful through good times and bad are people we tend to admire. We appreciate commitment and faithfulness. Now it isn't easy, and if we relied on ourselves, you could probably say it's even impossible. But what's impossible for us isn't for God. Jesus said so, and he said it most clearly with his own life. He was faithful unto death, death on a cross, and the Father blessed his faithfulness, raising him from the dead. And St. Fidelis, well, he was true to his name, faithful unto death as a martyr. With God's help, such courageous faithfulness is possible.